All right, let's just let's just talk about this social anxiety shit. Cause a lot of y'all think that that shit is really gonna affect y'all or some shit. That that shit, you guys really don't know what the fuck is going on with social anxiety or just anxiety in general. You niggas don't really know what the hell is going on. You guys actually think that that shit's gonna affect you for the rest of your life? It's not gonna do that. But let, let's just talk about this shit. Cause I, like I gotta break this shit down. Cause y'all don't know what the fuck is really going on. Okay, this shit ain't really gonna affect you for the rest of your life, nigga. It's just you don't understand how to how to you don't understand the power you have. And you don't understand how it's how to use it. You know what I'm saying? And that's what's fucking you guys up with social anxiety. Some people think social anxiety is caused by like activities or some shit. Or quote unquote addictions. Like I told you guys that shit ain't real. Addiction no there's no such thing as addiction unless you believe it's real. Then you can create that shit for yourself if you want that. If you want to have an addiction, you can believe it, and then you can create an addiction. But addictions aren't real. So that's what this whole social... People really believe that's caused from a certain addictions when I told you addictions aren't real. Okay? So this whole social anxiety shit, I'm going to break that shit down. Even though you probably had social anxiety when you was a little ass kid, nigga. At that. So, and you wasn't addicted to shit. Okay? Even though you're not addicted at all. You wasn't addicted as a kid, and you had social anxiety. Some people think you that shit causes so... Bro, I'm gonna just break this shit down right here, bro. This shit, because niggas be getting me mad over this whole addiction shit. Addiction ain't real, okay? So let's just, let's just get straight into this shit, okay? Okay, now, before like I even talk about why you even have social anxiety, let's, let's just talk about, like, like, bro, you not, when you enter your season, bro, when you in your season, bro, you're not dealing with that shit no more. As a matter of fact, you gonna actually know that you're entering your season when you stop having that shit naturally. When you start realizing, nigga, I'm not really nervous or ain't. When you start to really feel, it's like little by little, it's going away. But you start to feel that, nigga, that shit ain't real. I don't really have social anxiety no more or some shit. I don't really have anxiety no more like the way I used to. That's actually a sign that you're entering in your season. That's a sign right there. When you start to see that you 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 not getting, you know what I'm saying? That's a sign that you're getting, you, you, you're entering your season, Okay. So, so this doesn't just say that. But when you're in your season, bro, you're not having no more anxiety and shit. And the reason why I'm even making this video because a, 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 a subscriber asked me to make this video in the comment section. But, you know what I'm saying? That's like when you enter, once you enter your season, bro, you're not having no type of anxiety or none of that shit. That's actually, bro, I'm going to talk on that shit right now. But I'm gonna, let me just get into this shit, okay? All right. So, like, like I said, your life is going to be the complete opposite when you're in your season. You, it's gonna be the complete opposite, bro. That shit's gonna be completely the opposite. The, the way you look, the way you was in your down season, it's gonna be the complete opposite once you enter your season. Okay, that shit's gonna be the complete opposite. You're not gonna, it's not gonna be the same thing. It's not when you enter your season of receiving, when you pretty much transform into your greatest self, you're not gonna have it's gonna be the complete opposite. You're not having that shit. It's not gonna be in your life, nigga. You're gonna actually look surprised, like, nigga, I thought I used to be. You're gonna look back, like, how the fuck did I used to be have anxiety over shit like that? It's not going to be in the same season, bro. It's just not, okay? And, and like like I said, you're going to be... When you enter your season, nigga, you're going to be confident as fuck. Like I made in that other video, the season of receiving. Confident as fuck, fearless. Okay, you're not going to be afraid of shit, okay? You're not going to be afraid of shit. Ain't shit going to affect you. Nothing is... You're going to be... Comp, like, like, I don't know how to say this shit, but it's, I don't know what the fuck y'all niggas need to hear. You not gonna have to deal with that shit. That was just some shit that you didn't understand, and that was just that anxiety shit was just. And that's really just your, see, your low season. It was actually meant to happen like that, so that when you enter your season, it's gonna be greater. But it was just you didn't know better. You didn't know what the fuck was going on. Okay, but even still, like that was just some low season when you was in your down season type shit. Okay, like I said, when you turn, like you gonna turn into a fucking divine being, like literally like an angel. Is an angel afraid of shit? So, like, is an angel, like, think about it. Is an angel afraid of anything? Is an angel confident? Is an angel scared of shit? Does an angel have anxiety? Think about that shit. Nigga, ain't no fucking, bro. Ain't no shit like that, bro. All right? All right, now, now we, gonna, we gonna break down why you even have anxiety and shit. All type of anxiety. We gonna break that shit down. Okay, why? I'm gonna understand. Because you don't understand this shit. It's not really a shit. Okay, I get it. That was you and your low season. But there's a reason why you, you, you was having that shit. 
Okay, and there's a real, real spiritual reasoning why you it, you kept on it. Fuck, it fucked with you. It's probably fucking with a lot of y'all still. Okay, but because you might not just answer, you you probably not in your season yet. But I'm gonna break this. I'm gonna just break this shit down, bro. I'm gonna just break it because you guys don't understand this shit. Okay, but but it, here's the shit. Here's the reason. Okay, first of all, let me just start from the beginning of this shit. Okay, you come from high. We as chosen ones, right? We come from high spiritual realms. That's just what it is. We just naturally come from high spiritual realms. So naturally, our soul is that powerful stuff that when we're in this body and we're in this planet, and we're on it, we feel every fucking thing. We feel everything. We can feel every type of connection to the planets, to the plants, to the fucking animals, and to people. Okay? To the water, wind, anything. We can feel all that shit. Okay? So we feel people's energy. Okay? We feel people's energy at a high-ass level. That's that's what the fuck we do. We feel people's energy at a high ass level. Okay, we just do. Okay, we feel people's energy at a high level, and we can feel the connection at a high level. Okay, we do. This is what the fuck we do naturally, without even trying. It just it just happens naturally. You don't even have to think about it. As a matter of fact, you didn't even know you you didn't even know about this shit when this shit was happening. You weren't even aware of this shit. You just naturally did, and you thought everybody else could do that shit. You probably thought everybody had that ability. No, they don't. No, they don't, nigga. Okay, but that's what the fuck we do. Okay, we feel people's energy at a high ass level. Okay, and what and what what's it called? So like when you out, okay, like when you out anywhere, you feel people's energy, nigga. You feel and people's energy. You feel that you feel everything. Okay, when you outside, when you go out, this is why you have social anxiety. Okay, I'm gonna break this out because when you outside, you felt their energy. Okay, okay, and it was at first even like. For the longest, it felt sensitive as fuck to you, okay? This is what happened when you just outside all the time, when you out in the social society, probably, you, it, it felt, you that shit, you felt that shit. You felt people's energy naturally. And it was pretty intense, this shit. The shit was intense, okay? The shit was intense and it was low-key sensitive. It hit you sensitively, you know what I'm saying? The shit hit you so it hit your aura very sensitively, okay? When you felt people's energy like that, that shit was a little bit intense. And it was, this is when you wasn't in your, in your season of receiving, okay? When you're not transforming, this is, not, this is when you're not transforming yet. This is just you at your lowest or whatever. When you're not transforming. But this this was, you just, so before that, okay? Because I told you, when you're in your season, when you transform, man, you, that shit ain't going to affect you. But when, before that, okay? Before that, nigga, that shit was intense. Because you didn't, listen, this, this is why it felt so intense, Okay? Because you didn't know you could do this shit. You didn't know you could pick up people's energy. You didn't know you had... This is actually a power. You being able to read people's energy, absorb their energy, and feel their energy is actually a power. Okay? That shit's a power. And most people, I told you, cannot do this shit. They just can't. Animals can do this. Okay? But most people can't do this. Chosen ones, we could do this. Okay? We could read auras. We could do all that shit. Naturally. Without even thinking. We thought everybody else could do it. No, they can't. Okay? So that's why when you first started growing up and getting older and shit, you just naturally started to feel awkward or fuck. It just started to feel weird to you. You know what I'm saying? Because it's a power. You are being able to being able to absorb people's energy is a power. Okay. So 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 that's why it felt awkward as fuck. This shit felt awkward, bro. This shit felt awkward. This shit felt weird. Okay. And, okay. And it actually made you nervous. That's that's why you felt nervous as fuck, nigga. Cause this shit is weird, nigga. Like you, you gotta remember, you don't, you're not even aware of this shit. You don't even know, cause at a, I told you, you do this at a high level, so it's actually, it actually hits you weird, and it's just like, damn, this shit is kind of intense. Like, so now you, now naturally, what, what you will do is naturally, fucking high, like shield yourself, okay? Because you don't like that feeling of how, how intense that shit be, okay? You don't like that feeling, okay? Cause it's really intense. It really is intense. Especially when you're at your low season, when you're already not that confident in yourself, when you're already just dealing with a lot of shit. That shit is intense, nigga. Now, mind you, you knew how to do this shit probably as a young ass kid, okay? You probably was even getting anxiety as a young ass kid. I'm gonna talk about that after. But, nigga, that, that's what the fuck was going on, okay? That's what the fuck be going on, okay? This shit feels intense. And the reason why it's so intense is it's not just because you're picking up one person energy. You're picking up everybody in the fucking room energy. You're picking up everybody in the room energy, multiple people energy, and not just that. A lot of people are looking at you. And I told you why they're looking at you because you're a chosen one. So they feel your energy too. 
okay? So you dealing with all that shit, like, what the fuck? This shit feels weird as fuck. What the fuck is going on? Nigga, because then you feeling their energy, like, this shit weird. So naturally, you're going to defense mechanism and just feel nervous and anxious and shit like that. You, you get it? No, I'm saying, like, bro, this shit is weird as fuck. Because, nigga, that's, you don't, you didn't even know you could do that. Okay, and it, you didn't you didn't know you were absorbing people's energy at that extreme level, and not just that, nigga. You naturally wasn't like a person who just, you know, what I'm saying you just want to mind your business, do your own thing, but it's like feeling weird, and that shit naturally your defense mechanism will make you go and feel nervous and shit, and make you feel. But you will go. I told you you're extremist, so you will really feel too damn nervous and shit. Now you scared, and now you have anxiety and shit. Okay, that's why you have social anxiety, bro. That's why the fuck you have social anxiety. Is that's is that simple? It's that simple. Okay, it, it, it's that simple. It's because you can't even handle it. You didn't know how to handle that shit at the time. You did not know how to handle energy. You didn't know how to harness energy, different type of shit. You did not know any of that shit. Okay, and that's why the fuck you had a lot of anxiety, nigga. Because you absorb too. You just do it. You are literally an energy absorber. It's like a magnet absorbing the different shit at it. So you naturally go in. And then people are staring at you hard as fuck. People are you just reading you. Like, that shit made you feel weird. Okay, and you naturally probably was at the time in your life where you just they didn't want any attention on you. You didn't want people with too much attention drawn to you. And you did let us be real, that's another thing. You did not want attention <laughs> drawn at you. So you didn't really like, want people staring at you and shit. You was probably in a shell, okay, not trying to be do too much. You just trying to be do you trying to get where you're trying to go and leave. Okay. And that shit and then now you have too many people staring at you, nigga. Yeah, you just, that shit make you feel weird. That shit made you feel weird. You didn't even like that shit. And it made you feel nervous, okay? But the main reason is because you absorb people's energy and you didn't know how to handle that shit. And again, okay? Okay, but like I, like I said, like like, like I said, like, but your, your natural instinct, okay? I'm going I'm to I'm keep talking on this shit, but your natural instinct, okay, is to like be afraid, nigga. Your natural instinct is to put yourself down for your friend because you didn't know how to deal with that. Think about it. If you was, think, just think about this shit, right? If you was on, like, if you was, like, this is your first time driving, right? Let's say this is your first time driving, you learn how to drive, and whoever the fuck is instructing you just throws you on a highway and say, nigga, drive, drive, drive. And now you have to try to drive on this highway at full speed. This is a fast, that's highway. You're going full speed, and you don't even know how to drive. You know what I'm saying? You don't know how to drive, okay? You don't know what to do, Okay? You just looking everywhere. You like, what the fuck going on? And that person ain't helping you at all. That person's not helping you. Okay, that person ain't telling you what to do. But you just have to learn to drive. What the fuck you think gonna happen? You gonna get nervous as fuck, and you gonna get scared, and you're not gonna know what the fuck to do. Okay, you just not gonna know what to do. You just gonna get nervous, scared. You shit. You might even try to stop and shit. You might even freeze. Now you're not gonna freeze, but you because you didn't freeze in real life. But you you just gonna try to figure it out. Try to figure it out. And then hopefully you get off that shit, okay? But that's that's what the fuck is gonna happen. Eventually you are gonna get used to it, but that's what the fuck. That's it's, it's just the same shit, okay? You just naturally started absorbing people energy at a high level, and then the shit, the shit felt weird at first. And when I say first, this shit could be two, three, five years, ten years, okay? It could just, it, that's how long, that that's this is the beginning because your life ain't over, nigga. Ten years of your life compared to the rest of your life ain't shit. You know what I'm saying? Ten years of your life. Five years of your life ain't shit compared to the whole shit. And again, as you the older you get, the more intense this shit gets. Cause you're tra you're literally transforming. Okay, you literally are transforming. Okay, so so that's another thing. Okay, and, and guys, you been had this shit when you was born. You been had this ability when you was born. Okay, you been was able to freaking, you know what I'm saying, read energy and shit like that. But as you got older, you know what I'm saying. You was able to absorb energy and read energy, and you was just a more powerful being. You started to get more powerful, and more powerful, and more powerful. The older you got, so the more powerful you got, the more fucking intense that shit could be. And then you wasn't used to that shit as a young ass kid because you was a, you was a kid. You wasn't really aware of that. But as you got older, that shit started to get weird, and then it got intense. Now you're getting anxiety and shit as a natural defense mechanism because you didn't know how to. You know what I'm saying? Deal with that shit. See what I'm saying? You, you didn't know how to deal with that shit. Okay? Like I said, some of y'all probably started getting that shit in elementary. Okay? You start, that's probably when it started for you. I don't know about you, but that's probably, that's like, I noticed that shit started for me. 
Okay, that's just that's when I noticed this shit started for me. Okay, but like I said, like that's what the fuck was causing all that shit. Okay, that's what the fuck is causing all that shit. Okay, and remember, okay, like I said, you are an energy absorber, so you absorb all energy at one time. You just do that shit. Okay, and you could also feel energy. Okay, you can feel people's energy. You know what I'm saying all that shit, all right? But again, when you transform. That shit over with. That shit, that shit is literally over with. When you transform, you don't gotta worry about none of that shit. Cause you naturally not gonna, you just naturally not gonna give a fuck. Go and watch my season of receiving video. You go, I'm gonna th say it all here, nigga. You not gonna care, nigga. That shit ain't gonna affect you in any way, shape, or form. All right, that shit ain't gonna affect you in any way, shape, or form. Okay, and nigga. When you start to realize that you don't really have any more anxiety and shit, like. When you don't really, you know what I'm saying? When you're going to places and you just naturally like, well, bro, I, I don't really give a fuck no more. I, this shit ain't affecting me no more. That's a sign that you're entering your season. Okay, that's a sign. There's many other signs. Does that mean that it's going to be, you're going to get all your shit right away? No, nigga. But that's just a sign you're entering that season. Okay, because when you're in your season, nigga, anxiety and shit ain't going to be, <laughs> nigga, that shit ain't even going to happen. Okay, you not, I'm, t I'm telling you, you're going to be fearless as fuck. Like, bro, this shit is, is going to be crazy. But yeah, that's that's pretty much it, guys. That's why you deal with anxiety and shit. Nigga, just understand, you got to understand that you got to know your power, okay? You got to, once you understand that shit, you actually naturally start to realize, nigga, this shit ain't even what I thought it was, okay? And not just that, nigga, as you transform what you are going to, nigga, all that shit going to disappear, bro. And you never going to have that shit. You might be nervous or some shit, but you ain't gonna have that shit, right? You do not, all right? But that's about it, okay? Don't fucking worry about anxiety and shit. Don't worry about anxiety. Don't worry about none of that shit because it's not going to affect you, all right?